Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for the 26th or around the 26th or something like that. We're just going to see what comes up. Timing is fluid. There's a feeling of being disgraced, okay? Somebody may be feeling disgraced. Um, there's a, somebody's under a lot of social pressure, you know, having a hard time doing the right thing because of, you know, society. I, what I see is the Hierophant reversed, which is a lot of social pressure. Hmm. And there's a time for closure or something like that. I see 99999, and I saw that earlier today as well. 999 is about closure. It's time to move on. When you see 999, it is a sign to move on. So there may be a time. It's time. It's time. Lovers. So the lovers is a choice. Choice between two. Unexpected choice. A union. Now this is also a card of consequences. Be prepared to live with the consequences of your choice regarding whatever choice you make. There's two options here. Somebody has two options. And it's an unexpected choice. It's like you can... What are you going to do? So there's an unexpected choice in love and somebody's in the process of making a decision. So interesting. Justice. Yeah. And this is indecision. So there's, a, there's a, some indecision in regards to a union. What should I do? Who do I want? Which way do I want to go? This is a level of indecision. This is also bad karma. We had this earlier, in the earlier daily vibe, it was right here. So anyway, this is an indis in injustice or an indecision here over a choice. So somebody is very undecided, right? Hmm. Now this is something happening very fast. This is something rushing right in. Very similar to the one that I did earlier today. Now, this is a shock. We have a shock here. Somebody may have this shocking idea and take a new approach. This person has no fear. I mean, the Knight of Swords is kind of like... Something that happens so fast. So yeah, I feel like we do have something that is going to happen so fast. You don't even... Or it did happen fast. Hmm. Somebody is rushing. I mean, this is very much rushing. This is very quickly... This is a lot of clarity. This person has something on their mind. And it's like they're making an entrance. It's like they're headed towards a union very quickly. Somebody's headed towards a union very quickly. And it's, it is, that, these are both levels of unexpected. So somebody is being faced with an unexpected decision. An unexpected choice. And there, it's like, with the justice reverse, it's like, there's been some sort of injustice. And somebody has been having a hard time. They've been having a hard time bringing finality source to a situation. Or they may have experienced some bad karma. Hmm. This is an unexpected choice in love. But somebody is very undecisive. Hmm. This is a very sudden situation. Something happens suddenly. So it's like there's a sudden opportunity here. There's definitely a sudden opportunity. Ooh, the high pre... Totally unaware. Did not see it coming. Somebody was completely unaware, and it's like you really did. This is totally unpredictable. 
somebody has been keeping their feelings to themselves or something like that. They've been keeping it to themselves, not telling somebody how they feel, perhaps. It's, but they got this sudden notion, this sudden, sudden thought or something like that. It could be dealing with a Gemini. It could be dealing with a Libra. There also could be somebody here that had some hidden agendas. Just saying. This is hidden this is hidden agendas and this is unfair treatment. But this is not seeing a situation clearly. Somebody hasn't been seeing a situation clearly, but this is getting clarity. So somebody may be getting some clarity about who they want to be with. Why though? Ah, oh, they are getting clarity. This is seeing a situation clearly. Now, this is a card of consequences, and this is a card of somebody may have suffered some karma because of their actions or their inaction, and now they're wanting to take action, or they suddenly decide that they need to take action, and it is about their emotions. It is about their feelings. Somebody suddenly feels, it's like they feel for somebody, and it's like an instant, it's like, I know, after not knowing. That's what it is, like, I know. All of a sudden, they know. They know that somebody isn't being treated fairly or they wasn't being treated fairly or they aren't being treated fairly or that something like that. But now there's like two people coming together that are meant to be together because somebody is seeing the situation. It's like they know. They know. There's no more confusion. Ah, the Ten of Swords, very similar to the one I did this morning. Ten of Swords has been a betrayal. Somebody is feeling defeated. But this is the end. The end of confusion. The end of illusion. The end of... of well, I was going to say loneliness. It's almost like it's, but I don't feel like it's something, I don't know, I think it's not over. <laughs> That's funny. It's not over. I, I said it before the card came out. I feel like it's not over. And then the death revert. It's not over. This is like a reunion. There's a reunion. It's not over yet. It's not over yet. So I feel like there's some, some, some sort of. There's two people coming together that are meant to come together. Everything happens for a reason. Somebody is probably suffering some consequences or they have suffered some karmic consequences for their poor decisions, perhaps. But this is the end. But it's not over yet. It's the end of... of a painful situation because there's two people coming together that are meant to come together. But this is like something isn't over yet. This is a celebration or a reunion of some sort. I feel like there's going to be a reunion. I do. This is a celebration. And it is definitely unexpected. I think there are two people coming together that are meant to come together. And it happens very unexpectedly. It comes from some sort of injustice. There's, there's an injustice that brings two people together suddenly. Somebody definitely hasn't been seeing a situation clearly. They've been through a, a repression. They've been through a... It's almost like a very karmic, it's definitely a karmic time. There's been a lot of suffering, there's been a lot of pain. Somebody's been feeling the pain. But now, through that pain, they've received some sort of clarity. 
and it feels like they receive the clarity about which one they want. A seven of swords, page of pentacles, and page is going to be a message. Somebody is going to receive a message from somebody that is, it could be a little flirtatious, could be from a crush. This is somebody who wants to start over. I feel like we have a reunion here. There, I do. I feel like this is a reunion of some sort. Um, this person is, is, and I feel like this is good for some reason. This is the seven of Four swords. I feel like this person feels like they have the, it's like all the cards in their hand. This person has left something behind and he's going going to go back for it. I don't know. I feel like we we This is a very uh sneaky individual here. Somebody is going to receive a milk, uh, Malcolm. That's funny. Maybe we're dealing with a Malcolm. A welcome message. This is a welcome. Somebody is going to receive a message that makes them feel good. That could lead them down a new path. It's like this is what you asked for. You. This is what you've been waiting for. This is the. This is the message you've been waiting for. This person's been waiting for the right time. And it feels like it is the right time. So I feel like somebody is going to receive a message from somebody. It could be somebody that deceived them in the past or they felt deceived them. This person may have some some uh, tricks up their sleeve. But I don't think it's bad tricks for some reason. I don't feel like it is. I feel like this person is... It's almost like it's a surprise. Somebody is about to get a big surprise. It's like this is a golden opportunity to start over. I think it's a very emotional time. Somebody has been is feeling, they're feeling like they want to support or they're feeling like I don't know. It feels like this is love. It feels like this is love. I think we have a reunion here. This is the time to celebrate. I think there is uh, two people that are coming back together that are meant to come together. It's almost, I do. I just want to say reunion. This is a reunion. I think it's very sudden. And it has to do with a betrayal of some sort or some sort of injustice, some sort of lies that brings somebody together out of, out of despair, per se. Two people come back together. Could be an earth sign and a water sign. I just happened to look down. Um, doesn't have to be. I think I think this is this is somebody who finds the backbone to focus and learn new things or do new things to be successful. This is also the a card of manifestation. This is also this is like a new beginning to start or somebody may be receiving an apology. Somebody could be receiving an apology. I'm sorry for what I did. I'm sorry for treating you unfairly. Perhaps that is unfair treatment under there. So I feel like in the near future, there is going to be some sort of unexpected reunion. There is. This is a, a, a solid opportunity to start over. If somebody is willing to take the steps and not give up and open their heart 
and express their emotions. So I feel like there is going to be an, an expression of love or an expression of something that is very kind and gentle and loving and emotional that could lead somebody down a new path and it could lead to something solid and stable and it happens very suddenly. It's like a sudden, it's like a shock. It's like a shocking feeling. It's like I know what I want. And because of that death card reverse, it feels like this is something that is ended, that is not over. It's just, it's really, yes, it may have ended, but it's just not over yet. So yeah, I feel like we have a reunion here that is coming up in the very near future. Good luck.